Hi, this is Dr. Thayer. I am with Abraham. He's from New Mexico. He's come all this way because he's uh, been hurting for a while. Uh, five years, right? Yeah. Heavy smoker, two packs a day. Um, heavy drinker back then, too. But he, he beats himself up because he goes, I was drinking too much, smoking too much, I was carousing, all that womanizing. Uh, <laughs> womanizing by its ex, ex, ex womanizing. <laughs> <laughs> so, anyways, he was only, uh, back then, he was only uh, 21, right? Yeah. She said, so I'm like, who doesn't do that shit at 21? <laughs> so, um, I'm like, don't beat yourself up. Anyways, he quit cold turkey. He goes, this is terrible. I can't yeah. do this anymore. And ever since then, he had a nicotine kind of withdrawal thing. He went to the emergency room about two weeks after he quit. Yeah. Uh, shaky, anxiety. And ever since then, he's had this pain settle in. It hasn't gone away. And so I'd be curious if anybody else has ever had that, if they quit cold turkey. I bet it's very hard to quit two packs a day. I mean, that, they probably thought you were nuts. Yeah, yeah. But if anybody else has done that, I'd love to know if you had the same kind of reaction he had. I feel heavy, just really heavy around my shoulders, and sometimes my my hands go numb. You know, my shoulder area it yeah. really hurts a lot. So when you, you say know? heavy, how much pain on a scale of one to ten does heavy mean? Um, I think it ranges like just a couple days. It was like a nine. You know, like right now it could, it's like an eight. He's been in pain so much. He's seen how many chiropractors? I've seen like seven over in New Mexico, <clears throat> and in the last three years. Some, yeah, gotcha. And I got some relief, but nothing. Nothing. How many have taken X-rays? Zero. <laughs> I want to take x-rays. Yeah. And so uh, when you guys see his x-rays, we'll go over, uh, I can go over them right now. So not one of them taken an x-ray in three years, okay? And so when you see it, there's tons of imbalance. Uh, scoliosis in his back, he, he goes scoliosis, 15 degree scoliosis in his back. I think even the shittiest chiropractor would like to know that. Um, <laughs> Uh, Atlas is off, um, low reversal curve, which is very important in his neck to understand how we're going to fix him. You're going to see him get better around on camera. But again, I only know that when I take x-rays, chiropractors, take them, please. We have a 12 millimeter right imbalance, 10 degree scoliosis and lower right shoulder. Here we have a 15 degree scoliosis and right short leg. Here we have horizontal atlas and low reverse curve with a wisdom tooth. And last one, we have evidence of that constipation we were talking about. Uh, tell us about your headaches. How often do you get headaches? Oh, like at least three three times a week or even more. You know, I'm always taking aspirins. Gotcha. Like uh, vertigo every day. gets dizzy all the time too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. When I'm doing something at work, you know, like I get up and I feel like a little dizzy. Yeah. yeah. Carpal tunnel. Tell us about your arm too. Yeah, like just my hands, you know, like they feel like stiff, you know, and sometimes they, I get like tingly sensations. Yeah, yeah. Heartburn once a week, right? Yes. Gotcha. And then uh, constipation? Yeah, that too. And yeah. the sleeping too, you know, like yeah, sleeping, too. sleeping. Yeah. yeah. And uh, still has anxiety too. You can kind of see how he's kind of twitchy yeah. right now. And then he has this thing called chicken skin. I got to show you this thing. Chicken skin. And so look at these little speculations here. So I guess it was, I thought it was redder, but it's not that red. So I thought this morning it was, um, see this side? Put your pant leg up. Why what? Your pant leg? Look at these boots, not that cool? <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna put a little like this. That's all I shit. I like his boots. He said, as a doctor, pull your pant leg up. Touch your toes, please. Any pain in your back there, sir? Yeah, a little bit on my lower back. On a scale of one to ten, what is that? Uh, maybe like a five. Gotcha, and what about your knees? How about your knees? No, but I could feel the stretch. Yeah, how, how, how much the stretch is now? Like a good, like a five or like a six. Five yeah. or six, gotcha. Yeah. Back like this, please. How about that in your back? Yeah, uh, I could feel it on the lower back. How like much five? There? Like a five? five. Okay, look at the floor, please, your neck. How much pain in your neck there, sir? I can feel like, like a three. Like a three? Right here. And this is what he came in for a three. So he came in for his neck, but he also, take, he also took some aspirin before he came in here. Look at the ceiling, please. How about that? Um, yeah, like a three, two. Like a three also? The bottom. Gotcha. Yeah. So just relax. Are you nervous at all, Abraham? Abraham? Just a little bit. Good time. Good. Wow. What's the wow about? Well, they've always adjusted my neck, but not like like that. Yeah. So like that was a, lot, a, lot, a lot more deeper, you know. Mm -hmm. Normally, when they adjust me, it's just like a quick, like, like boom, boom, mm -hmm. and they put my head back, and that's it. Yeah. Just felt like it was a little bit more impactful. Oh yeah, that, it was just like like a deep, deeper. Now tell them, did it hurt at all? No, no, no. That felt great. I mean. That Yeah, he's not, he's a little scared on the side. Take your time. Okay. Good. How's that, sir? Wow. That was just great. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna help Abraham up here. Again, of course, always telling our patients not to twist or turn or they will undo my work. Here's your damn hat, buddy. So let's see how he's doing. 
I feel just a little, um, just a little dizzy. Interesting, right? And um, right when you pop the this side, I felt like a, like a ringing in my ear right okay. away. You know, gotcha. and then you pop the other one. That's the lunch and bell. It, and it just went. Food's away. on. Soup's <laughs> on. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but I felt that instantly. Now it kind of disappeared, but I just feel like uh, just. Now, next step to getting better is walking down the hall. Why? Because we recalibrate. We're sending that adjustment from the neck all the way through the body. And the only way that happens is by movement. So he's walking up and back, kind of feeling his oats, and we're going to send him back down the hall. Uh, let's check out, see how he's doing. I think he's looking pretty good. I feel like a little lighter, cool. you know? And I just feel like, uh, just like a little tingly sensation mm -hmm. on my hands, you know? Okay. But um, cool. I feel Something like a little bit... Just a little more calmer than it was before. Crazy, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So let's go through the range of motion, see how you're doing. Just take your time, go ahead and bend over to those, please. That was a five in your back. What's that now? Um, I actually don't feel that on my back anymore, but oh, I can feel just leg. like the... That was a six, six you know? behind your legs. Yeah, but I do feel like, okay, like, well, like I went like a lot more. Really? I can't believe <laughs> it. <laughs> Definitely. Yeah. That's, that's crazy. Like it doesn't hurt as much, but I could just like... Like I could feel it, you know? Yeah, 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 yeah definitely. <laughs> yeah. Go ahead and go back like this. Wow. That's crazy. Um, I just feel like it doesn't even hurt that much anymore, you know? It was but, a five minute ago. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's like... <laughs> I could feel like I could go more back and it actually doesn't like... It doesn't hurt. Like I, can, I can't feel it that much. Look down the floor, could look down the floor. That was a three. It's almost maybe like like a two, you know, gotcha. but it doesn't feel as much like pressure Tired, like man. I was feeling this end. And it's the same, like I could it still hurts a little bit, but it's not it's cool. like a two one down one. So why don't you give uh, for all those people who have seen seven chiropractors in the last three years who have had pain and and wonder if it's worth it to come here? Because you said I ain't going to California because <laughs> it's cheaper to be here. New Mexican <laughs> chiropractors, New Mexico, New Mexican, New Mexico chiropractors, <laughs> they're just as good as California. What do you tell them if they're thinking on the, on the fence? Yeah, uh, um, we're not done yet. We're gonna get more videos, but uh, right now, what do you think? It's better to go with somebody that knows what they're doing, other than like I thought like those people knew what they were doing, but they. I felt some sort of relief, but not like this much, so yeah. fast. Cool. Yeah. Cool. I just get like really anxious if I don't have food inside me, you know? So like yesterday, after the adjustment and everything, I was hungry, so we went to go have dinner, but I was a lot more calmer when I was driving around, you know, like I didn't have as much anxiety, and we got to the place, and like, it was it was different, completely different, different than like. Uh, so not just your body felt different, but your mind felt a little different. Yeah, yeah, too. I felt a lot calmer, and I yeah. wasn't like as anxious as before. Where I'm like, oh crap, I need to get there. Now yeah. tell us about this hearing. What's this hearing thing? Oh, well, the hearing too. Yeah, like it was weird. So I had that ringing in my ear, and just now, like I had noticed, like like I could hear a little bit better. And you know, I told you I listened to loud music and all that kind of stuff, but I also like I could hear like a little bit better. Yeah, you know, so. It, Weird. Yeah, weird. Yeah. I started driving a little bit, and then I started feeling just a little bit. How would you sleep? Um, it was just normal. It was fine. Okay. And you slept better. You said sitting yeah, well yeah. rested. Yeah. Now tell us how much better you are, are you overall, like in a percentage scale, between before before yesterday's adjustment. I would say I'm at least fifty percent better. Wow. Good. What was that like, dude? That felt like a lot deeper than yesterday's. Uh, tell us about what you learned just a few minutes ago about posture also. I learned the zombie walk. The zombie walk. Okay, well, let's go with that. The zombie walk. <laughs> and uh, is it going to be easy to learn, you think? Um, I think so. It's just getting okay. used to it. Used to it. But, Good. Um, okay. I did feel like just by doing that, it like relieved some of the pressure that I have on my shoulder, you know? Kind of cool, right? It. Yeah, just... I felt that like all the way through. Like that was that's the hardest side to do. I think this one mm -hmm. and that. Wow. Was Can I come this way. Tell us how your sleep was last night. How, how your sleep was, and how medication has changed for you. Yeah. So I'm not taking my pills. You know, like on Monday I did take them, and then yesterday I didn't feel like I needed to take them, and I just went to sleep fine. There's no tossing and turning. The only thing that woke me up was the baby, but. <laughs> I still slept a little bit more after That's that. That's your so. fault, by the way. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and so what is the big thing you've learned this week to do? Um, the posture. And posture to do what? Um, 
try to be loose. Just and, loose and relaxed, right? Yeah. yeah. And it's an oxymoron, right? You're like, I'm supposed to try to help myself, but by help myself, I do less. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Good. Yeah. Well, I learned a lot about my posture. I had a lot of relief from my neck, you know, which is my main part that hurts my neck and my shoulders. And I don't know, I would say at least minimum, like, 50% feel better, you know, but I mean, it's been a week, so it's not that long and I've had these symptoms for even longer So I know that everything takes time for your body, you know, yeah, so yeah. I know that I have to work on my posture a lot more Yeah, again, tell us about your headaches Well, initially when I got off the plane, you know, like right away I had a headache, bad headache, migraine mm -hmm. and um, When I got here, you told me not to use pills or anything like that But even right when I got off the plane, I bought some pills big bottle of pills because I thought I was going to use them all week and ever since that first adjustment I didn't have to use any pills till now you know so that's a big game changer. Is that a yes, game changer? Is yeah. that unusual to have that? Oh yeah definitely because it was at least minimum three four times a week you yeah. know like Neck, almost all headache, week you know to just yeah. like massive migraines you know. Yeah oh, migraines I didn't yeah. Well, migraines. well like migraines but they were they're bad you know. So tell us about the uh, vertigo lightheadedness dizziness you used to have it all the time. Yeah you know like, you know we went out on a boat ride yesterday and it was a little bit because it was also my first time like a bigger boat but um Doing whale watching or something yeah that's exactly exactly <laughs> yeah. so I know. But it, did you get that group on yeah <laughs> and so you're on the boat you got a little seasick a little bit yeah but it wasn't too bad you know yeah. like i feel a lot um i bet balance, i bet yeah. if you would have gone before you would have been chucking over the side i, I think so too yeah, yeah 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 now tell us about your carpal tunnel well yet. i didn't have carpal tunnel but just the tingling, tingling? you know but well, i did see like uh it reduced. Yeah, I it haven't was. had it like. Oh, I had it maybe like once during the week. Gotcha. Normally, I would have it like every day. Gotcha. So it's a lot better. Now, what about your calf tightness? Um, you know, it hasn't really. It's only been when I stretched down, but um, I haven't really noticed. Did it you used much. to notice it more often? Yeah, yeah. My yeah. feet. Well, I'm on my feet all day, so I would notice. Gotcha. It hurt okay. A lot more. Now, what about the um, sleep? Um, it's still getting there. You know, it's getting better. But I, I, I noticed that. I'd feel less, like more crappy if I woke up and, and I was like, oh, I haven't slept all night or what, or for a few hours. But now I'm a lot more calmer about it. Yeah, what about the anxiety too? Uh, yeah, I'm a lot more calm. Less of an asshole? Yep. <laughs> or I, li I like to think His so. wife, his wife told me this. I'm just <laughs> repeating what she said. Heartburn, you had it once a week. I don't know if that's any change, any change yeah, there. No, I've been eating some spicy stuff, but nothing. Gotcha. Yeah, it's been it also says you're full of shit here. How's your constipation? <laughs> Um, no, it's been, uh, it's good, it's good, everything's good, good. Yeah. I'm not full of shit. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> sure. Yeah. Okay, so how much pain is this? 10. 10, right. I'm pushing on them to try to get the brain to decompress and to make it feel like it's balanced and relaxed. Okay. Do you feel pain up in your head when I do this? No, just on the shoulders. Okay. No. Okay, and I'll push on his neck watch. You guys will love this. So oh, he just had a massage, by the way. How was the massage? It's great. It was great. Good. And so uh, right now I'm pushing a muscle in here that uh, really is tight because of his shoulders and posture still. Yeah. Good. One more side because he likes it so much. <laughs> At least somebody likes my jokes today. I say they like it all. Conspiracy in football. Mm. Mm. 